Early Indiana bat roost research focused on which tree species this endangered bat preferred to roost in. However, as more and more trees were added to the list, it became apparent that the species of tree was not as important as the tree condition, location, and microclimate within the roost. With this in mind, forest management techniques such as tree girdling to create snags or timber harvests that include a snag retention component became popular mitigation strategies. In addition, experiments with artificial Indiana bat roost creation began to take off. Most of these early designs targeted locally abundant bat species and were similar to man-made structures such as window shutters, roof tiles, barns, or abandoned houses. Some designs attempted to mimic tree roosts used by Indiana bats by attaching pieces of wood or fiberglass to poles or existing snags. Success of these structures varied greatly by site and maintenance proved to be problematic in terms of both cost and labor. A cost-effective low-maintenance artificial roost that was also resilient and better mimicked the conditions and appearance of natural Indiana bat roosts was needed. With this goal in mind, Copperhead Environmental Consulting began working with wildlife biologists at Fort Knox, Kentucky and Replications Unlimited, one of the leading producers of artificial outdoor scenery for zoos, parks, and displays in the United States. This partnership led to the development of a new artificial bark concept dubbed Brandon Bark, a product available exclusively from Copperhead Consulting. Brandon Bark utilizes the realistic polyurethane elastomeric flex bark created by Replications Unlimited and is uniquely designed to allow bats to grip and hang from the bark's undersurface. Brandon Bark can be made in a variety of sizes and is designed to replicate an assortment of simulated tree species and has been used at Fort Knox with remarkable success. Our design has been developed and tested on natural snags and artificial trees between 2009 and 2012. Studies conducted by Copperhead Environmental Consulting show that temperatures under the Brandon bark are comparable to those found under natural exfoliating bark and that Copperhead's design provides the visual cues necessary to attract Indiana bats. Both natural snags and artificial trees outfitted with Brandon bark were utilized by Indiana bats within two months of installation. 70% of the snags were used by Indiana bats throughout the summer season, especially during the critical gestation and pup rearing period of spring and early summer. Exit counts conducted at active roosts showed an average of 91 Indiana bats and a high of 242 bats using the Brandon bark. Copperhead provides artificial roost installation and consultation services from beginning to end. We provide the habitat assessments necessary to determine the number and proper placement of our design and will work with local contractors and suppliers to ensure correct installation of our product. Copperhead has over 80 years of combined bat research experience and offers a number of options for continued monitoring of bat populations after installation from basic exit counts to large-scale radial telemetry studies. If you are interested in learning more about this unique product, please contact us at Copperhead Environmental Consulting by phone at 859-925-9012 or by email at information at copperheadconsulting.com.